Hello, hello, and welcome back to more some movie logic. In the last episode, we gave a girl a letter that doesn't deserve it. I'll take his letter. I don't care. Soon. Just soon. I raised my arm in front of the members. Tukasa saw me and looked at me nicely. You made it then. Yeah, I did it. I'm so happy for you. Aww. I hugged Tsukasa. That's adorable. Look at this artwork. I'm just gonna appreciate for a sec. I think Tsukasa's really short. Or apparently Sumigu jumped. Thank you, Tsukasa. You helped me a lot. You're useful only about love. What? Is that a backhanded compliment, Sumugu? <laughs> Only about love? Tsukasa looked a bit upset and left me behind. It was a short friendship between us. By the way, why did you take that notebook with you? Huh? I noticed that my notebook was still in my left hand. I was supposed to take it to Kotoko. But I forgot about giving it to her. After giving her the letter. Well, Kotoko will ask you again if she still needs it. You're right. Ah, your smartphone was buzzing on the desk. Oh, who is it? I checked my smartphone. I'm coming to Japan for the summer holiday. See you soon. Oh yes! You will come back! You? Who's that? Ah, you is Kotoko's brother. Oh, the guy in the photo. Yup, he's studying abroad. You will come back in September. So, if Kotoko accepts you, you should tell her brother this too. Oh my god, you're right! What should I say to him? Wait a minute. You still don't know what Kotoko is going to reply to you. I know. I remembered about Kotoko's reaction a while ago. Kotoko looked happy when she received the letter. I hope so. Kotoko said to me, I'll write to you. When will her reply come to me? Tomorrow? Or next week? I think she'll reply to me before summer vacation at least. With hope and fear, I was thinking about the first summer vacation in my university life. Who am I going to spend summer vacation with? Uh, we don't know. Sumugu, we just don't know. 